Good morning, everyone. I'm coming to you this morning on a very rainy Tuesday. Unfortunately, it's been kind of dreary the past couple of days, which honestly, I'm not complaining. It means it's a lot cooler. So today we have Paradise Fiber Package for July. I'm actually really curious about this one. I managed to avoid all spoilers and I did not open the hint email. And also, it's a completely black package, which in my experience with Paradise Fibers, they usually match what's inside to the package, so I'm curious whether it has something to do with the packaging or if they just ran out of the fun packaging. I guess we're going to find out. But I'm going to cut this open and we're going to see what we got for this month. Let's see. And I apologize for the crinkling. With these sort of bags, there isn't really much I can do to avoid it, unfortunately. So another card or just the oh, Okay, they're stuck together and that's why. Paradise Fibers July 2021 Fiber Club Northern Lights featuring our new Multi Merino and Aurora Fiber. Alright, let's see. Northern Lights, introducing 11 multicolor merino tops inspired by the Aurora Borealis. Four ounces of one of 11 colors. Okay, cool. And then Aurora, streams of vibrant colors undulate against a luminous shade of chartreuse in our newest blend of merino, bamboo, mulberry silk, and sari silk. And your bag is approximately three ounces. Okay, cool. Very cool. I have a sweater idea in here. And they recommend spinning from the fold to preserve the colors. Okay, cool. As a side note, the Aurora blend looks very similar to something I've spun before. I don't know if, I don't think I was filming at the time though. I think it was before I started the channel. I had like a pound of it <laughs> that I'll eventually make a sweater out of. So in the future, if you see me making a sweater out of what looks like Aurora, it's very similar to Aurora, but not quite the same. All right. So pretty sure this one's the Aurora and it's in a little green bag. Yeah, this is exactly the same. You can see that. You can see all the pops of the different types of silk and bamboo in there. I do love this blend. It was one of my favorites. I know it's been out of stock for a while. <laughs> that, but um, yeah, it's very pretty. And then we got, I wonder which color I got. It's in a dark blue bag. I think this one is Harmony, which is like teals as well as blues. And there's also a light periwinkle in there, I think. Yeah, it's very pretty. I'm not sure if I'll spin it with the Aurora though, because I'm not sure if those two go together or not. I'm gonna have to think about that. Now, as for our extras this month, they're in this little cute bag with stars on it. I'm already excited about these from what I can see. So we've got what is probably the prettiest Yuna sticker I've seen yet. And it's like an Aurora Borealis sheet. This one's going on my wheel. I put my favorite stickers on my wheel. This one's going on my wheel. I love that. And then we got, for the tea, we've got Chamomile Nights Stash Tea, which is Chamomile, Spearmint, and Lotus. All right, not sure if I'll try that or not, but I will put it in my tea basket so anyone in my household can try it, which is what I do with a lot of these. I'm pretty picky. That's just the way it is. And then we got hot pink highlighter tape for 
highlighting lines in a pattern. thinking about this stuff the other day but I don't remember why. There's a reason. I just can't remember it. And for the stitch marker we've got a little star. <laughs> All right so these should be fun to spin. I'm going to think about it for a few. Well right now it's the morning. Probably after lunch I'll know what I want. Good morning. So my finished Paradise Fiber spins are all skeined up. Uh, this one is the Aurora Blend plus two plies of the Mulberry Silk that I dyed from the last box. So it is very heavy on the silk content. And then the one next to it, I had started running out of the green silk from last month. So it's one ply of the green silk and one ply of some leftover silk singles I had in my stash. Uh, mostly pink and red, if you can see it. It ends up having kind of a confetti look. This one is two bobbins full of the Harmony Merino, plus apply each of the Romney from the fleece I've been spinning, and a Mohair Nylon Merino blend from Spunky Eclectic. And this one's a pretty big skein. Um, I think once I wash it, I'll know for sure what I want to make with it, because at this point I'm having trouble telling if it's going to be more of a drapey yarn or more of a good cabling yarn. It's a little hard to tell at this stage, but I think once it's washed up and relaxes, I'll know better. Finally, with the last little bit of Harmony, I applied it with two plies of the Romney only. This one I'm pretty sure would be a good cabling yarn. Alright, so that's it for Paradise Fibers for this month. I really enjoyed this box, and I hope you enjoyed watching me spin it. Have a great day, everyone.